Hi, my name is Lance Cole. I'm with USA Wallet. What USA Wallet is, is it's a simple, safe, and secure way to buy cryptocurrency with just a click of a few buttons. No more entering long addresses, no more worrying about if you actually are purchasing what you think you're purchasing, and all around, no more really having to deal with some of the trials and tribulations of getting into cryptocurrency. We want to make this essentially something that can allow any lower, middle class, or even upper class American to get into buying cryptocurrency. USA Wallet, we're here for you. Thanks, Lance. Bob here, and we're back. USA Wallet was formed two hackathons ago as a proof of concept and an MVP. Many of you may remember this hot mess. Well, we've scrapped all that. To reach more people, we came to this hackathon to upgrade our website to a mobile app. But Morales, our Web3 engine, wasn't quite ready to support React Native. So while we're waiting, we decided to redesign the whole thing to be mobile friendly and have a new look on the front end. Ta-da! So now we're narrow format, mobile friendly, very easy to sign in by unlocking, just validate. Here's a display of the user's portfolio. And of course we can see our transaction history. Our trade route starts with selecting a token, how much, and this is the short list of verified tokens that we would like to offer our users to keep them safe from all the crazy stuff that's out there. Buying crypto was another headache this time around. We wanna keep everything on Polygon to dodge mainnet fees for our end users. Difficult in the United States to link up a US dollar with a Matic or USDC on Polygon. So here we are using Transact to go from USD to USDC within the United States. Now we can send any token we have in our portfolio to an address or we can receive and we give you a QR code and the address for copying to the clipboard. And as always, we have dark mode. Feel like you don't need that much help from our little pop-up X, you can turn them off. So that was the evolutionary part of this hackathon. Let's talk revolutionary. So we're developing a utility token to control access to discounted trading fees based on token in your portfolio. So to that end, we introduced Benjamin's. What's it hardened against? Well, against speculation and price manipulation. We have a bonding curve that's going to control the price. Any DEX activity or, or speculation will be arbitraged away against our minting and burning functions. Volatility and user losses. We have a 100% reserve ratio and a nearly flat inflation rate versus the circulating supply. Sloan attacks, and it's also hard against regulation. It's really not worth front running. Nobody's making any money here. We've carefully removed any and all excuse to label this thing as security. It's just a utility token. It's a way to purchase a discount on our trading fees. How this works is as you buy more Benjamins, you achieve new levels of access, and each level of access will uh, initiate a new lockup term, and they get bigger and bigger but you get higher and higher access. Once the staking term is done, you can sell off the tokens and keep your privileges. We have 100% reserve of all funds used to purchase Benjamins and we deposit that at off for interest. We keep the interest. Long-term doesn't really cost you anything, but we would just like to use your money for a bit. Our contract code is done. Unit testings are running and we are in the midst of an internal audit before an external audit. We're gonna publish soon to M Mumbai after the internal and then to mainnet after an external audit. So that's our status at this hackathon. We have evolved our front end. We're getting prepared for Morales IO support of React Native, which should be out later this month to start building our native apps. And we have created a whole new utility token from scratch during this hackathon. So thank you for your support. Looking forward to the future with y'all. Thank you